In this video, you will learn how to create a heat map in Tableau. So to create a map, you will need to have a geographical variable in your data set. In this example, we do have a state variable, which we can simply drag and drop in the white area. And Tableau is smart enough to recognize the names of the states and find the right map for it, which in this case is the United States. There are two main map graphs in Tableau. If you want to change the default one, you can go to the top right corner and click on show me, which will allow you to switch from the current graph to a possible graph depending on the data set that you choose. In this example, we're going to choose the second map here. And if we click on it, each state will be fully highlighted if it exists in your data set. Right now they're all in blue because we have not chosen to highlight them by color, which we can do by choosing the color icon over here. So if I had hide the show me tab over here, you will see that each state is represented by a different color, but that color of course does not represent any value such as sales or profit because I have not chosen that variable yet. So I'm simply showing the states that show up somewhere in my state column. Now, if I wanna show the name of the state on top of each state that is highlighted here, you will need to add a mark as we have mentioned in earlier videos using the label mark here. So I can drag and drop the state variable to the label area here and that will show the name of the state on top of the highlighted area now in addition i would like to allow users to deselect states from the map if they're not interested in data related to those states to allow them to have more flexibility on the visualization. So for that, as we discussed before, you will need to use the fillers. Now the filters are used to add filters that allow users to select and deselect data points. So I'm gonna filter my data by state and by default, I want all of them selected. So I'm just gonna apply it. And as we discussed before, the filter is not shown by default unless you choose otherwise. So if you want to show it on the right area here, you'll have to click on it and change the setting to show filter. Now, this list is too long for this type of filter. So I can change the way it's represented by clicking on the triangle here and change the setting from mul multiple values list to multiple values drop down that will allow me to save some space i can also now hide my card which shows the legends for each state because i already showed the state names on the map itself so this is no longer useful now i want to have a heat map as an end as an end result and that heat map represent sales by state so if i want to do that i would need to drag my sales variable and drop it in the color area and now the colors of the states represent the amount of sales they have generated and by default tableau chose a color shade for me which in this case is blue I can change it to a different shade like red and green as an example or green and blue so let's choose red and green in this example so now what this tell, tell us is that California has the most sales compared to all other states because it's the darkest uh, in green color and then 
there are many states that share similar darkness of red so i'm not sure which one exactly is the lowest but you could see that north dakota nevada they're kind of similar right so i can now change my sheet name to sales heat map apply it and i can also change my sheet name to sales map this is it for creating a heat map a simple useful heat map in tableau